Right. Okay. So I need to go and do the... I need to fix relations between these two. And I was also going to go and check out that, like... I'm guessing it... Well, yeah, it was like a Norwegian. No, not Norwegian, but like like Scandinavian, like Nordic kind of thing. Why is my game so laggy? I gotta go see their village. I need to start mending relations, and I also start, need to start trading with this village a bit. So I need I need to go back home for a little bit. Let's go talk. Oh well, let's clear my inventory first. Then we'll go talk to uh, Mitsuri. Hey, the village. Yep, your status is friend of the village. Hello, friend. What can you do? Okay, so I'm guessing this isn't the highest status uh, I can get. So I need to trade a bit more with them. Hmm. But you guys look the same. Yeah. There you go. Lots of friend of the village. I need to trade more stuff with them. So I'll go. I'll go grab stuff and then. It's, you know, doing stone. Stone might be the fastest way. Let's see. Uh, three by three. No. Uh, right. There's. I can. Ma right. Vein mining is in here, so I, I could do that. I think I'll make a diamond pickaxe then, in order to actually optimize the amount I can get. Where's my sticks? That makes some, I guess. Is oh pick so diamond ingot oh stoked crucible oh okay so how do you make a stoked crucible so it, it's an unfired crucible and that is clay in a turntable and a turntable is plank siding Jungle plank siding. Oh, wait, no, I think it's any wood. Chiseled stone. Well, just four stone, a clock, and a wooden gear. So a clock is not bad. Okay, so you. So a clock. I have stone here, so it's gonna be four. I need a wooden gear. So let's see. Cruise. Uh, no, turn table. So I need a wooden gear. So that's. Four sticks for planks, which is no problem. Do that. So let's do you, you, you. Oh, yeah. Is that wooden gear? Oh, we're mechanist journal. Okay. So you. Oh, wait, no. You there. You here. I need wooden side side slabs. Let's see. So I need. I need a saw, which is oh, okay. A leather belt with leather strap, so it's cut leather. So I I need tanned leather. Oh my goodness! Okay, today's the day where I need a ton of different things to actually make things work. We need more wooden gears, so I need. To, oh wait, no, 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 no! I'll leave this here because it keeps it in there. Okay, so I need two more wooden gears. So let's do that. Do you? Wrong way. There you go. Wait, what do they need? Right, I need a saw. Three iron, two pieces of wood, a leather belt. So let's grab three iron. Two pieces of wood. And a leather belt, which is four leather straps, which is shears and cut, cut leather, cut tanned leather, and tanned leather requires manure, score scored leather. I need a millstone too. Okay, that's a stone and a wooden gear. Scored leather. So I need a millstone. Yeah. So it's just one gear. And eight stone. All right, millstone. A millstone, so let's see. Pretty... Oh, I see. Okay. Millstone. Millstone can receive a mechanical power from a hand crank or an axle from the top or bottom. When powered, the gear inside turns and crushes materials into a finer form. Okay, so I need a crank. Hand crank. So it's two sticks, 
wooden gear, two pieces of cobblestone. Okay. Two sticks, two cobble, and one gear. Hand crank. Oh, it's loud. Okay, so there's that, then I need, let's see, so, so I can get, no, I want a cauldron, which will turn it into tanned leather. I you make bark? Oh, it's just that and a saw, okay. But I need this, this first, so I do need to go, so I need one bone, one bucket of water, and seven iron ingots. Okay, so I need, I have manure in here I got my bucket which I'll grab some water with let's see bone iron bucket there you go cauldron Okay, so now in the cauldron, I need to do what? Ah, manure and the thing in there, yeah. And the you. Let's do uh, you. Now is it working? Well, I'll just put the fire out. I get this to work. It's important to note that additional fires within a three by three reach of will make it cook food and other recipes, which much faster if you were to just use one flame. Okay. There we go, now it's cooking. There you go, tanned leather. So leather, okay, so now I need my shears. Let's shear the tanned leather into cut leather straps. That into the leather straps. I'll cut leather and then leather straps. Are you spinning around, what the fuck? I don't know why my mouse does this. Leather belt. And then the leather belt in here makes a saw. Why is there a hole in my roof? Hmm. The saw, yo, yo can you move? There. Oh. <laughs> don't think that's how it's supposed to go. Oh, um. Is it how it's supposed to go? Let me just put it like Okay, I guess it's supposed to go on the wall then. Oh, let's see, it's from the same, yeah. So, so let's see, how do you do that? Saw, okay, the saw is a mechanical block that uses for cutting blah blah blah. Yep, it might as well additionally use When powered in a block with the recipe is in front of the block, it will chop the items from the recipe. When powered. Does it need a, this thing too?
No. Can't be powered by a... What? Oh, come on. It can't be powered by a hand crank? I mean, I assumed so, but like, oh, it needs continuous power. Does the book say that? No. It does not say it needs continuous power. If I had done that, oh, I wouldn't have used the hand crank, because I can't use the hand crank. Alright, so let's see. Windmill is probably a continuous thing. Windmill. So windmills are the most basic way of mechanical power aside from the hand crank. The, ba the faster a windmill blows, the faster the axle will return. When it is raining or snowing, it will turn far too fast for a wooden gear to handle for more than 30 seconds. The player can prevent the gearbox from being overpowered by supplying a redstone signal directly to it. Each of the blades of the windmill can be dyed with click by clicking on the windmill block for the vertical windmill as mid the lay. Oh my goodness, this is gonna cost a lot, isn't it? Windmill. Wind sail the windmill. Wind sail is hemp cloth. Hemp fibers from hemp. This is a lot. Do you want I'm not gonna do this. <laughs> It's a lot to do, and I don't have the resources to do it right now. Somebody clicked. Somebody clicked. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm just gonna harvest rice for them. Dude, I got tons of rice for you guys. Ugh. Okay, so they're lacking resources in this, so they need seven more oak wood. I can do that. Yo, like hold up one sec, but I, I got I can get you seven more. There you go. Now do you have enough? Yes you do, you have enough for this. There you go, now it's been good construction. So what? 36 meters east, alright, so let's see. So it's this way. It's been begun construction, where is it? Oh, there they are. Let's watch them build. He's got to connect it now. Okay. And it's connected. Okay. Toshi Michizuki wants to be a warrior. Oh, what the fuck? What? What? What did I just see? He just, just in, before my eyes, went from child to man. I am a warrior now. I want to be a warrior. Therefore, I am. Okay. Sure, bud. <laughs> oh wait, I could trade in here? Oh, okay, I see. Alright, well, what what's their next building project then? 17, they need oak, tw they need more oak wood. What is this? Um, a chicken farm, okay. So they want six, eight more oak wood. I can do that. Oh, you got a new outfit on. Nanami Mochizuki, okay. Take all this oak wood. Boom. Construction. They are working on the chicken house. Well, chicken farm. 64 meters north. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, geez, lag spike. Okay. This is a fishing house, I guess. Fish Hello there. My name is Hideki Watanabe. Fishing is time consuming work, and I don't know if I will be able to meet my quota today. Do you think you can. Oh, sure. Thank you. Four raw fish should be enough. Return them to my wife, and she will repay you. Okay. I need a fishing rod then. Okay. A fishing rod. All right. So he needs four raw fish. Sorry, but I don't need a. Yeah, I don't don't need any. What is that? Raw snapper. I need the normal raw fish though, I think. <laughs> After this one, I'm going to, uh, going to replace, well, I'm going to dump my inventory a bit so I can get some lots of fish. Eh. It's another fish. Go dump my inventory and I'll fish through the night. What? What? The villagers of Hachino have noted your disgrace. Reputation lost. I lost reputation because I couldn't grab a damn fish. Which reputation does he, does he lose? What was that? Oh, another raw char, okay. What was that they got? Hey, this is a post-Toru, I guess I'm gonna call myself for editing Toru, you know? But I had to kind of like, I had to put this in in the video because uh, I, I'm not sure what happened with the OBS, but there's this giant black box that is from my Steam messaging. So I was messaged while I was recording from my friend and well, I, I just decided to leave that open and talk to them and little did I know that OBS thought that I guessing it thought it was supposed to be captured or something so it put it on the screen but it wasn't sure which thing to capture it I'm just taking a guess here I don't actually know why it happened but it pretty much just overwrote the area that it was in I'm guessing maybe one of my instances were actually like above my Minecraft and it tried to capture that but it I don't know, maybe you couldn't capture it properly or something like that. So it's just a black box. So, and that black box is present through the rest of the video. And I couldn't, well, honestly, I don't think it would be a good video if I left that giant black box there. So I'm just going to describe what happened. So pretty much, uh, I had figured out that the fish I was capturing, like those weird looking fish that were from the mod pack, they could have been actually converted into the normal raw fish of the crafting. And... That pretty much means that I could have technically beaten the, the quest that I tried if I had known that, obviously, I, which I didn't at the time. But, well, I figured that out. And then the second thing was uh, I went on to explore a little building that was nearby. It didn't really, it didn't really have anything in it, but it was just there. It looked, looked kind of cool, so I, I checked it out. And then after that, I got some building materials, like some wool stuff I had to go around looking for, and, and the normal oak wood, because they never have oak wood. They always have a ton of spruce, because they are in a spruce biome. But I, I did that for them, got the materials, and they built another building. I can't really remember what the building was for, but yeah. Also, yeah, if you were wondering from the chicken part, uh, yeah, that the chicken, uh, the chicken house thing, I just walked in the opposite direction, because I'm stupid. <laughs> All right, so... 
little bit of a makeshift ending, but thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video because I had to cut that part out because I also had the big black box in there. But yeah, uh, leave a like if you liked it, minus the black box, or maybe you do like the black box. Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one.